Shalom, my friends from here in the Holy Land. I wanted to send you a big virtual hug and to say Toda Raba on behalf of myself, everyone at the fellowship, and the people, most importantly, who rely on you every single month. You come through for them. You give them hope and comfort every month that you are there with them. So I wanted to take this opportunity to introduce you to my friend Tamar. And we are going on a road trip to one of my favorite places, the beautiful, amazing Mount Carmel. One, two, three, four, get my shoes and out the door. This is the Carmel mountain range in the northwestern part of Israel. This is where one of the biggest biblical showdowns in history happened. One of the things I always think about here is how Elijah was one surrounded by all the people who were worshiping Baal. And it's something I think about so much as a mother, how my kids, like, I tell them to have values, I tell them to stay strong, I tell them to be faithful, but it's in a world that's so dark. And when I see the story of Elijah that happened right here, I always think about how eventually that faith pays off. Eventually people realize you were the one who had it right the whole time. After King David and King Solomon, the 10 northern tribes of Israel were here, and they started worshiping Baal. It's crazy to think about, there was idol worshiping going on by the 10 tribes of Israel, specifically in the high places. This was a holy ground for Baal. Wow. These are amazing rocks. They're a nice sort of look at them to climb. <laughs> I see it's opening up ahead. Wow. It could have been a place like this where Elijah set up his altar and fire from God came down and consumed it. It's amazing to me that we're standing here. You can, you like, can like, feel really it. You can feel it. We're at the highest point and right down there I can see the Valley of Megiddo and the Kishon River. And these are the three points that come together in the Bible that tell us where the showdown happened. In 1 Kings chapter 18, verse 20, As I sit here in the very place where it happened, and I read these holy words, I think of you. How what Elijah is saying is choose something you believe in and go with it. And you have done that. You have stood up with your words in prayer and in action for Israel and the Jewish people to say, your God is my God, your people is my people. I hope that this has raised your spirits and that you enjoyed traveling with me and my friend Tamar. I pray that you will be blessed for blessing Israel and that this video has served as a blessing. And I'm just happy that you came along to travel Mount Carmel, one of my favorite places.